everyone and welcome back to another episode of Average Guy Does DIY. It's me, your average guy, here to do some more DIY with you, here to test out some DIY with you, and you just have to subscribe to me now if you want to watch this much. Today we're going to be doing a super, super easy DIY. I saw this on BuzzFeed. It looks kind of useful slash useless. It is a tennis ball key holder thing. I lose my keys all the time. I don't even know where my keys are now. There are many mornings where I get up, I'm fine, getting ready, and right before I have to go to work, I literally lose my keys and I can't find them, in addition to my wallet, my cell phone, and my dignity. All you need for this DIY is a tennis ball. I love tennis, fun fact. A push pin, scissors, a knife, or this thing. You know, these sharp things. What is this called? Very dangerous. If you're young, use scissors. <laughs> They're less dangerous than this thing. I have a blade, a blade of something. So all you're supposed to do is cut it open so it has a little opening, stick a pin through it, take the pin to the back so it goes into the wall, Now you leave it at the door, and then you can draw a little face on if you want to be cute. So what do you say? Should we get to making this ball into a key holder? Let's do it! Here we are. So we're gonna start off with some little eyes for this beautiful, there's the face. We're taking this guy and we're slicing. It's childproof, so that's probably why I can't open it. This is dangerous. Okay. This is kind of hard. What is going on? Woo! You get a little sweat. How do we get a hole in this? This is not cutting. Come on! What is going on? Oh! Pop, lock, and drop. Come on. Serrated knife. Oh. Oh, there we go. Yes. Look at those teeth. Okay, tip. Use a serrated knife. Hey. Okay, is this big enough to fit my keys? Ugh. Let's not look at my barcodes on my library card. Is it gonna make it to the wall? Pick this in. Come on. Oh, I'm pushing the pin. The pin is in the back. You see that? Right there. There's a pin coming through. Let's take it to the wall. Come on. We're going to the wall. Okay, so you see there's a little pin sticking out of the back. I'm using all the strength of my finger to into the wall is not really working. I think I might have to glue something else to it. Uh-oh. How does this work? Oh my gosh. This DIY was supposed to be fun. Oh my gosh. There we go. Holding it in place. Oh, this was a struggle. Going into a mirror. Damn, there we go. Cutie little cutie. Oh, great. Number two. Oh, oh my. Oh, how do you get it to stick? Do you have to wet it? Bam, yes. Oh, one more try. Oh, that is hot. Oh my God, this whole thing's burning. What do I do, what do I do, what do I do? Give yourself some time, people. Okay, we're gonna let this dry. I'm gonna come back later and we'll deal with it then. It's been an hour. Oh, 